guys welcome back to another vlog so i am making some dinner for jay tonight so i'm making a shrimp pasta and getting everything all ready here um this was a new recipe that i was following and it turned out so good you guys so yeah i made the pasta there and there's like spinach shrimp garlic olive oil there's like so many goodies in this pasta it was so delicious you guys there's like parmesan I loved it, it was amazing. This is how it turned out and Jay said it was so good. I got you guys, I'm so excited. So I got this Tanologist Express Tan from Shoppers. I had no idea if they sold this brand. And this girl that I follow on TikTok, her name is Alexa Collins, she uses this and I've been in love with her tan. And when I saw it, I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna get it. So I'm gonna try it out. It's an Express Tan, so apparently it like develops within one to four hours, which is amazing. I hate like being drenched and marinated in self tan um for like long so yeah i'll let you guys know how it is and it was pretty cheap compared to like saint tropez uh saint tropez is like 60 bucks canadian and this was 25 dollars canadian so not too bad um uh, but yeah i'll let you guys know how it is Alrighty, guys i just posted a new vlog go check it out i'm waiting for my friend tylee to come um she's gonna pick me up and then we're gonna go to the mall um we're gonna have kind of like a girls night tonight because i haven't seen her in a while and yeah I want to just catch up with her. Um, so we're going to go to the mall. And this is how my nails these look. And these are my natural nails, you guys. And then I'm also rocking the white toes. I haven't had white toes in so long, you guys. It actually feels really nice because I just put on self-tanner, like a fresh uh, tan. And I love white toes with a fresh tan. Like, there's nothing better. Um, and, yeah, I feel like really happy so I cut my cuticles as well because they were like getting gross so as you guys can see my nails are kind of grown out um but my cuticles are like freshly cut so they don't look too bad um and, and then I also did use the tanologist uh tan you guys this is how it looks I put it on this morning at like 8 a.m and I washed it off around 4 so it developed um, pretty well, I'd say. I usually like sleep with my tan on, so I probably would have been darker if I left it on overnight or something or left it on longer, but I wanted to do it quick because I felt like I wasn't tan and I wanted to, I wanted to be tan. But so far, I really like it and I feel like it's not streaky at all. Um, and yeah, so the reason why I got Tanologist was because I was actually at Shoppers. I was going to get the Saint Tropez one that I always use. And, um, I actually saw the Tanologist one at Shoppers and I was like, oh my God, I had no idea they sold it at Shoppers. And this girl I follow on TikTok, her name is Alexa Collins. Um, I'll put a picture of her or something up on the screen, but she uses Tanologist and I have been obsessed with her tan. Her tan looks so, 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 so good. And... I wanted to get Tanologist, but I didn't know they like had it at Shoppers. So I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna get Tanologist to sign. So yeah, you guys you need to convince me otherwise, but I really want to go blonde. Like, <laughs> I don't know why. I have just been obsessed with blonde hair lately. Like, I I don't know why. And this is my natural nail nails. Oh my god, I'm so used to saying that. This is my natural hair. If you guys are new. Um, but I really want to go blonde. So it convinced me not to because I just really want to do it. Yeah, I figured I'd sit on my couch so it's just like easier to look at you guys and talk. Um, but I really, 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 really want to go blonde. I had black hair for like, I honestly don't remember since I was in like grade like nine. Like it's been so long that I don't even know how my natural hair color looks like anymore. Like my natural hair color is like a light brown. But I've been dyeing my hair black for years and I literally like don't remember how my natural hair color looks unless i look at pictures but yeah i've been like really obsessed with blonde hair lately like bleach blonde hair and i really want to do it but i'm like scared of the damage it will cause my hair because this is my natural hair and obviously i'd have to bleach it because i've like box dyed my hair black for years and i know that's like the worst thing to do yeah, I just like really, really want to dye my hair blonde. I don't know. I want to try something different. I'm kind of like getting over the dark hair. Um, even though I love dark hair, like don't get me wrong. Dark hair is like my favorite. I love it. But I don't know. I'm just kind of over it. I kind of want to go blonde. Um, and do the McKnight twins. You guys, I'm obsessed with them. They're all I watch. And they both have like platinum blonde hair. And I'm like, oh my God, I want to go blonde so badly. And then like the Alexa or Alex Collins. I forget what her name is. But she's 
like bleach blonde and I just keep seeing a lot of like bleach blonde girls and I'm like I want to go blonde so convince me not to because I feel like I really want to but I also don't because I also don't wear makeup on a like day-to-day -day basis and I feel like if I was to go blonde and I don't wear makeup I feel like it would like wash me out I don't know because I'm just so used to like the dark I feel like dark hair with me like looks good without makeup but if I was blonde I don't know if I could pull off the no makeup look all the time like I feel like I'd have to wear makeup um otherwise I would look washed out I was gonna go blonde it would be probably like platinum blonde but I wouldn't be like to the root so I'd have like the um, I guess like shadow root or whatever it's called uh so it'd be darker in my roots and then it would go like into like blonde blonde like platinum blonde but I don't know so let me know what you guys think do you guys think that I could pull it off do you guys think that it would look good on me let me know what you guys think. If you guys if you guys have been blonde, was it really damaging? It's a lot of upkeep. I know it will be a lot of upkeep. And, like, I don't know if I'm, like, prepared for that. I don't know. I just kind of want to change. Like, I'm over the dark hair. But, like, I love dark hair. So, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so then after that my girl came to pick me up and we went shopping and we had some dinner So I had subway. I've been obsessed with subway. <laughs> it's so good. So I got a chicken teriyaki sub And it was delicious and I actually picked up a new sweater from Aritzia. So yeah, I'll show you guys what I got so um, if you guys don't know this already I am obsessed with the TNA butter zip up I don't even know what they're called at this point but I have like every color and I saw this gray one at the store and I was like I have to buy it so I got it in a size small and yeah it's this gray uh, cropped zip up and I wear these all the time and then this is how it looks like on me and I also want to show you guys my tan so this is how the tan looked as well but yeah this is how it looks I love it I wear these all the time and they are sold out online like every color is literally sold out in my size so when I saw it in the store I was like I have to get it and yeah that's how it looks and then the next day I went out we went to home sense and it was so beautiful that day it was so warm but I didn't really end up buying anything and yeah that is it for my week I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you in my next video bye